Trump care has got to go. Dozens of protesters rally outside a town hall hosted by Senator Ted Cruz. As Cruz spoke inside the Arboretum's Renaissance Hotel, protesters called attention to thousands of veterans who get health care under the Affordable Care Act. CBS Austin's Courtney Shoneman is live tonight. Courtney, you were in that town hall meeting tonight. Yeah, it was a question and answer session between the audience and the senator. It was a chance to talk about the issues facing veterans and their families. But it didn't take long for the topic of the Republican plan to repeal and replace Obamacare to be brought up. With the new health care law coming out, yeah. will it impact veterans at all? Senator Ted Cruz has openly expressed doubt that the proposed GOP health care bill will pass the Senate. But he told the audience tonight Republicans must keep their promise to the American people. I think it's critical for Republicans to honor our promise to repeal Obamacare. One man in the audience challenged proposed cuts to Medicaid. Cruz said the program is not helping the most vulnerable. Data are overwhelming that individuals on Medicaid receive, have, have lower, lower expectancies to be cured of diseases, that, that, that their health outcomes are materially worse. Vietnam veteran Dick Starry says he came to Cruz's town hall for two reasons to thank the senator for his help getting the VA Accountability Act passed, but also to shine light on the need for more compensation for Austin's veterans. And with the $587 a month I get out of the VA and my Social Security, I can't really live either. And for these veterans, uncertainty is the biggest hurdle. This is not what we don't know yet. We'll, we'll have to see how things are implemented, implemented and what kind of accountability there really will be. Now, in regards to the congressional debate on health care, Cruz says the central focus has to be reducing premiums. The senator will be at a similar event in Houston on Saturday. We're now reporting live in North Austin. Courtney Shoneman, CBS Austin News.